Arizona is home to the Grand Canyon, warm summers, and great places to live. One of the most popular cities in Arizona is Scottsdale, Arizona, with lots of housing options from exclusive luxury to affordable. The best neighborhoods in Scottsdale have something for everyone. If you're gearing up for a big move to this area, there is a lot to consider. When is the best time to move? What is the best place to move? And if you have narrowed down Scottsdale as your city of choice, then of course the next question is, what are the best neighborhoods in Scottsdale? And these are all really important things to consider. Now there are a lot of great places to live in Scottsdale. And a few things you need to consider when making that choice of where to live in Scottsdale are budget, your lifestyle, and your family. This list of the top five neighborhoods in Scottsdale takes all of this into account. So let's take a look at these top five areas to live in Scottsdale. Okay, number one is South Scottsdale. When I talk about South Scottsdale, I'm going to drill down into specific zip codes. And those two are 85257 and 85251. Now this is a quaint and somewhat artistic neighborhood and great for those people that want to be close to everything. Now this is a fun yet family friendly place to live. This area is home to several art galleries and hosts art walks every single week. The semi-cosmopolitan vibe gives the residents the best of both worlds. City life on a smaller scale. The median home price hovers right around $695,000, making it a more affordable area in Scottsdale. Now, the price range in this area is quite broad, starting at about $230,000 and going all the way up to about $7 million. Now, the majority of the homes in this area were built anywhere from the 1950s through the 1970s. So unless the house has been remodeled, you might find some of these floor plans a little bit compartmentalized. Now I say that, and I can honestly tell you that most of the homes within this area have been remodeled. So although the outside might look like the 50s, 60s, and 70s, the inside has been completely updated. There are also some luxury condos in this area. So if that's what you're looking for, you've got a few different options. You've got the waterfront and you've got Optima Camel View. Now, most of the people that live here love the proximity to Fashion Square and Old Town Scottsdale, so they can get to shopping and dining really quickly. And because of the proximity to Old Town Scottsdale and the nightlife there, this area is perfectly suited for those people that love the hustle and bustle of the city life. Number two, McCormick Ranch and Ganey Ranch. Now, this zip code is 85258. Now, if you like a little more suburban rather than urban, you will like McCormick Ranch and Ganey Ranch. These are both master plan communities offering a lot of amenities for those that live there. People that live in McCormick Ranch get to enjoy the views of the surrounding mountains, pristine lakes, and mature landscaping. Also sitting within the community is the McCormick Ranch Golf Course. Ganey Ranch is an affluent yet relaxed community that centers around the Ganey Ranch Golf Club that has three courses and has beautiful views of the McDowell Mountains. Ganey Ranch has nearly 20 different neighborhoods and they are all gated and a pretty wide range of home sizes and types. So if you're looking for anything from a condo to a single family home, you can find it right here. This area is also known for its lush landscaping and beauty. They also have paved paths through their green belts for walking, jogging, and biking, which is a huge draw to these neighborhoods. The median home price in these neighborhoods currently is about $950,000, with the range in prices anywhere from $300,000 all the way up to $5 million. The homes built in these neighborhoods were built between the 1970s and the 1990s, and you'll have single story as well as two story. Now, this area is very similar to the South Scottsdale area we just talked about, where many homes have been remodeled, some even torn down completely and rebuilt. Sitting right within these communities is the Seville Shopping Center. They have salons, boutique, jewelry, and decor stores, plus a wine bar and many other restaurants. There is also a brand new Sprouts grocery store, so you have everything you need right there. Number three is North Scottsdale, and this zip code is 85255. The flourishing North Scottsdale neighborhoods are known for their golf course communities, views, and lush desert. There are public and private courses, spas, boutiques, restaurants, and lots of other shopping options. The Frank Lloyd Wright design, Taliesin West, sits in the North Scottsdale area and houses an architectural school as well as offering tours, which is a huge draw for many tourists. There's also the McDowell Sonoran Preserve with lots of different trailheads like Gateway Trailhead, Brown's Ranch, Tom's Thumb, and Lost Dog, just to name a few. These are all popular for hiking, biking, and horseback riding. The most well-known subdivisions in this North Scottsdale area we're talking about are McDowell Mountain Ranch, Wingate Ranch, DC Ranch, Silverleaf, Greyhawk, and Troon. All of these communities started in about the late 1990s, except for Wingate Ranch, which had owners moving into their homes in 2008. 
you also still have some custom lots in these areas, so you can still buy a lot and build your own custom home. Once you get into the North Scottsdale area, you'll start noticing some more open spaces. This is what we call natural area open space or NAOS. These are dedicated areas of natural desert that cannot be touched. This allows for open space behind a lot of homes, distant views, and a lot of privacy. The median price point for homes in this area currently is about a million five, and the price range is about $330,000 all the way up to 32 million. You will find everything from condos to townhouses to single family homes in this area. Now there are still some new construction being built in this area. They are few and far between, but if new construction is something you're looking for, there are a few opportunities left. Now, because many of these neighborhoods also allow for custom homes, you will find one of a kind custom estates built in these areas. People love this area because of the proximity to the McDowell Mountains, as well as the elevation. So you can not only get the views of the mountains here, you can also get some city light views down towards Camelback and Mummy Mountain. They also love how close it is to the 101 freeway, which can take you just about anywhere you wanna go within 20 to 30 minutes. You are also just minutes away from Scottsdale Quarter and Kierland Commons, which are amazing outdoor shopping malls that have things like the Apple Store, Lululemon, Our House, Anthropology, and a lot more boutiques, as well as restaurants. Number four is Far North Scottsdale. Now the zip code I'm talking about here is 85262. For those looking for a bit of North Scottsdale, but want to be even a little further out, this Far North Scottsdale area could be for you. This area has elevation change, open space, mountain views, and a lot of golf. Within the zip code, you will find neighborhoods like True North, which is not the same as Troon Village. I know it's confusing. Estancia, Legend Trail, Desert Mountain, and Mirabelle. All of these communities are golf communities. Some are public and some are private. Now, many people love these areas because they're just a little farther removed from the hustle and bustle and a little quieter. You will also find a lot of second homes out in this area. Now, many of these communities are also manned gated, which people love for the security. And you will also find a lot of second homes here. Now, the median home price for homes currently in this area is $1,650,000. And the price ranges is anywhere between $230,000 to $55 million, which leads me to explain one of the areas within the zip code. Now, I want to point this out because if people are not familiar with the area, they might look online and see a home within the zip code and think, wow, this looks really affordable, but they don't know where it is in relation to everything else. So this area is called Rio Verde, and it is in the same zip code as the other communities we were just talking about. Now, it is a beautiful place to live with views of the Four Peaks and Red Mountain out towards Mesa. The thing to know about this location is that it's considered more rural, meaning that there are a lot of horse properties here. There are a lot of dirt roads. There are washes that do wash out when we have rain. And people out here are usually on a shared well or a private well. And because it's more rural, people that live out here are usually living on anywhere from one to five acres. But there are some that have even more. Like the home currently listed for 55 million, that is 237 acres. Now, the other thing to know about this area is it is governed by the Maricopa County. It is not governed by the city of Scottsdale like all the other areas in Scottsdale. So you will not have the same restrictions. Now, this is just for Rio Verde. All the other areas we talked about are governed by the city of Scottsdale. Okay, now back to the other area we were just talking about. Those that are living in those communities do so because they love all of the amenities. Things like golf courses, tennis, pickleball, gyms, and all the plethora of other social activities that these communities offer. Now, because this is a little bit farther removed, you do have grocery stores and things like Target and some other restaurants that are about 20 to 30 minutes away. But if you want to go to any department stores like Nordstrom's or uh, Neiman Marcus, you are a good 40 minutes away. And to get to the airport, you're 45 to 50 minutes away. And the fifth one is Paradise Valley. And this zip code is 85253. Now, I know this is not technically Scottsdale, but it sits right on the border of Scottsdale. And oftentimes when you're driving, you have no idea that you have left Scottsdale and entered into Paradise Valley. Now, Paradise Valley sits closer to McCormick Ranch and Old Town Scottsdale that we talked about earlier. And some of the reason that people love Paradise Valley is because it is closer in, but doesn't have the same hustle and bustle like the other areas we talked about. However, it is still close enough to get you to all of those amenities quickly. Now the lot sizes in Paradise Valley are averaging an acre in size, and it was done so by design when the town of Paradise Valley started. The owners wanted more land in between their homes. Depending on where you live in Paradise Valley, you can have views north towards the McDowell Mountains, or you can have them south towards downtown Phoenix. 
People also love this because many of the homes are very lushly landscaped. So you do not feel like you're in the desert. Paradise Valley is often referred to as the Beverly Hills of the Southwest and contains many luxury properties and high-end resorts. The median home price for this area is by far the highest on our list, coming in at $4.5 million. And home prices ranging anywhere from $275,000 all the way up to $30 million. Now, because Paradise Valley was started in the 1960s, you will see homes that were built in the 1960s right next door to a stunning brand new home. Now, many love living here because of the location. It really is easy to get to just about anywhere in the valley. They also loved how established it is. And if you are looking for an affluent area with no HOAs, this is definitely a place you need to check out. The beautiful views, our weather, and amazing events draw people to the Scottsdale area every single year. And more and more people are making their dream to live here come true. Now, if you like this video, make sure you take a look at these. If I can answer any questions for you, please feel free to reach out. As always, I thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.